We showed you this photo of a golden silk monkey last week. This is this year's overall Comedy Wildlife Photography Award winner. This was taken in China by Ken Jensen. It was chosen out of thousands of submissions. Tom Sullum is the co-founder of the awards, which started back in 2015. He joins us now to tell us more. Tom, thanks for being with us. Thanks for having me. How did this start out that uh, you wanted to have this contest? Uh, it was, you know, there was probably three very quick reasons. The first one was um, neither I nor Paul Johnson Hicks, the other founder, uh, could win any competition. So we thought, <laughs> let's have our own one. And uh, the second one was that we were both in East Africa photographing, and a lot of our wildlife shots were not the kind of dramatic, powerful, regal shots that you see in wildlife. They were off, I'd look at my lions and go, why is he yawning and his tongue's hanging the wrong way? And, <laughs> And we thought there must be a place for this. And then finally, it was um, uh, kind of linked to why would we bother doing this? And then we, we kind of decided and we'd read about humor creating empath empathy. And so we thought, let's try and use our, a competition like this to raise awareness of, of uh, conservation and wildlife. Just looking at uh, one amazing example after another there, how does the judging process work? Uh, it's it's uh, quite tough because actually none of us have the same sense of humor. So um, Paul and I narrow it down to sort of a best 500, which might sound like a lot, but it's very hard to distinguish after that. And then we have a smaller group that brings that down to 40. And then the judges, the kind of celebrity judges do their bit and we get a winner. What hmm. percentage of people, I mean, everyone's got an iPhone or, you know, a, a camera phone these days. Uh, what percentage are professional photographers or just someone who happened upon a great shot? Uh, well, originally in 2015, it was probably about 80 unprofessional or amateur and 20 professional. And now I'd say it's probably 50 50. Ah. The, um, the competition has kind of spread and it's quite a good one to win now because particularly guys like you, you know, this, it captures imagination. So it gets a lot of coverage, which is amazing for us. So we saw that monkey one, which is your overall winner. What's your favorite this year? Is that was that, is that your favorite? No, I like it, but um, the pigeon. I think I don't. You know, pigeons for me, I, I'm I don't really notice them. But for a little moment, for a leaf to stick to a pigeon's face, it's just it's a slapstick humor that happens to <laughs> right. Laurel and Hardy. It doesn't yeah. happen to animals. But there it is. It is. Oh, there it is, right there. Yeah, he's like, darn it. Uh, and what, exactly. do the what do the people win when you win this prestigious award, Tom? Uh, so Ken Jensen, who won the whole thing, he gets uh, some, like a six-star safari to Kenya, um, which is, you know, ah. it's a phenomenal, uh, it's, a, it's a free to enter competition, so all the prizes are, are great, but yeah. um, he gets a think tank camera bag, he gets um, uh, a kind of comedy wildlife goodie bag, which is stuff that we have on our website which you try and give away to the people who've done something special and what else does he get uh, he gets a portfolio website and then all the other category winners get uh, similarly they get camera bags they get um, our goodie bags so for the the main guy the, I guess the top prize is the the trip to Kenya and that's the big prize winner right, right. there I like uh, that we blurred out that area too by the way it's like <laughs> just trying to I give them a little that. little privacy there well Tom thanks so much for joining us for more information or if you want to submit a photo I guess for next year you can go to comedywildlifephoto.com or follow them on social media Tom thanks so much thanks Tom thank you thanks for having me